Hello everyone. Today I want to talk a little bit about investing and trading. I've been pretty interested in the stock market and learning to trade for quite a while. In 2018 when cryptocurrency was booming and everything, I invested in Tron, Ethereum, uh, Bitcoin obviously, and but uh, just a bunch of different alternative coins. And that really got my gears turning on how to use money to make more money. And uh, that's kind of why I'm really interested in finance too. So this time that we have right now has been a really great opportunity for me to just hone those skills and learn more about the stock market. The first thing I want to talk about is day trading. I started using this platform called Thinkorswim to start learning about day trading. And it has a lot to do with technical analysis um, when you're day trading because you're really just trying to make money off of small movements in the market. What you're trying to do is predict a very, very small time frame in the market. And with that guesswork, you're able to make money off of that. And there's a lot of things that you have to do in order to be good at day trading. You can't just go in right away and be professional. You have to think about it like being a lawyer or becoming a doctor. People put a lot of time and a lot of money into becoming a doctor, into becoming a lawyer. So you have to kind of think of that when you're going into day trading and learning the different concepts, learning and practicing with paper trading in order to really hone your skills on that. So that's what I've been doing in terms of day trading. Now I'm going to tell you all, if you're 18 or even 17 or 16, please get a Roth IRA, please, okay? That's going to be a really great choice in the long run. You won't get like super great short term gains. But what this pandemic has really taught me is thinking about the long term is the best. Okay, if you think about the long term about your finances in the future, then you'll come out on top. So please, after this video, research more about Roth IRAs. Personally, I use Fidelity. There are tons of different other organizations, but I was choosing between Vanguard and Fidelity. I eventually chose Fidelity for my own reasons. The main thing that I learned from this experience is that I'm going to keep learning, first of all, and also that long-term gain eventually outweighs short-term gain. Now, there's a reason why all these companies that are saying, hey, get rich quick if you do this, get rich quick if you do that. There's a reason why they are so profitable. It's because people can't delay their gratification. They just want money right away. And right now, it seems like, yeah, I want money right away because in the short term, things are going to be bad. But if we think more about the long term, eventually the market will recover, eventually the economy will recover, and eventually we will come back to relative normality. But right now, it's going to be pretty scary. I guess the overall idea is that we're going to get through this eventually. So I hope all of you are investing some time into learning about personal finance and also definitely setting up a Roth IRA if you don't already have one because it's going to be a great way and it pays great dividends in the long run. And there's a famous saying in econ that in the long run everyone dies, but at least in terms of us as humans, you can make a lot of money by just thinking about investing for your future. So I hope you're taking this opportunity right now. And I hope you all are staying safe at home. And yeah, so thank you all for watching. Thanks for the support from the last video. I hope to continue making videos, especially now that I have quite a bit of time. So I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.